Even though we sit way at the end of the bar, us Ravens fans, a lot of us feel like we are private investigators because we will take something that we see and we'll break it down, we'll analyze it, we'll criticize it, we will look at it from all possible angles to try to figure out what it means. And this morning, it was no different. Shout out to my guy Mayweather on Instagram. He sent me Lamar Jackson's story. Because Lamar Jackson is somebody who is very, very smart. He is very, very smart. Lamar Jackson knows that every single one of his moves, especially via social media, is always being watched. It's being watched by the media. It's being watched by the team. And it's certainly being watched by us Baltimore Ravens fans. And this move this morning was no different. But it's, a, it's an interesting one. Because I feel like with Lamar Jackson, so many of his moves are calculated. They're thought out. And some people could look at this and be like, oh, that's nothing. But I, I don't know. Is it something? Well, at least we want it to be. So to get to it, Lamar Jackson, uh, he, of course, has been missing out uh, for like what has been over a month since Lamar Jackson last played. I don't even remember what the date was, but it's been a while. <laughs> we, we've been missing Lamar Jackson bad. As Ravens fans, we've missing Lamar Jackson very, very bad. When he went out in that Broncos game, I remember so many Ravens fans saying, oh, is that, that's, is that his last game in a Ravens uniform? Uh, and me, I was like, no, nah, I ain't no way. At least not this season, at least. Maybe next year is a different story, but at least this season, no, it can't be. But then a game went by, then another 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 game went by. It's like, whoa, could it be? So now we've entered the playoffs. The Ravens are officially in the playoffs. They play the Bengals this Sunday night at 8.15 p.m., um, and that should be a really good one A lot of bad blood brewing in that one So it should be fun But the big question has been Is Lamar Jackson going to play? Is he going to suit up? Is Lamar Jackson going to make His long awaited return to the Baltimore Ravens? And if you look at his Instagram story Could this actually be A sort of message to Ravens fans? Could it be a sign to Ravens fans? Like hey I'm going to be back y'all boys I got you Ooh. We won't know till we know Well we won't know till tomorrow because that's the first day that they officially practice. But uh, one fan, he posted, uh, Fly Guy Tra Travon, uh, he posted, New Era, need you out there Sunday, and I need another win in Cincy again. And this one counts the most. And Lamar Jackson reposted it. And with him reposting that, you know, you know Lamar Jackson gets tagged in one million and three things, every, well, one million and eight things. Every single day. Had to throw the little number eight in there. You know he gets tagged in a million and eight things every single day on Twitter, on Instagram, on everything. You know he does. He knows he does. And sometimes he reposts them, sometimes he doesn't. But it's always interesting what he reposts and what he doesn't, especially because he, he, he knows what's going on. He knows what's being talked about. He, he knows what the conversation amongst not only Ravens fans, but just the NFL in general about him is right now, especially with this playoff game coming up. Is he going to be back? Now, throughout these past, what does he miss? Like the past four or five games, I think. I don't recall. Let me know if I'm wrong. Because I always say, let, please let me know if I'm wrong. But I don't recall him ever reposting anything that where fans are talking about, hey, you need to come back. Hey, Lamar, we want you out there. Hey, Lamar, we ready to get you out there. Hey, Lamar, when you coming back? I don't remember fans. I don't remember him ever reposting anything like that. I don't recall. I mean, again, let me know if I'm wrong. If y'all remember something, but I don't remember anything. But the, the, the timing of him reposting this was just very interesting. Because I know, I know it leads us to believe that, oh, could it? Could it be? Could this be the week? Could this be the big return that we have all been waiting on for so long? We hope so. We really do. Another interesting repost was a couple of days ago when Isaiah Likely, um, there was the video that Isaiah Likely recorded of Lamar Jackson getting his knee looked at on the, on the trainer's table and whatnot. And I, man, so many people. So I'm, I'm sure it's gonna say it's gonna happen today too. But so many people have sent me that video. They were like, "Look, look, Lamar, he's getting his knee worked on. Look, hey, I guess he ain't skipping workouts. Hey, I, I guess he ain't skipping the training table. I mean, he ain't skipping his, his rehab sessions. So many, so many, so many people. Look, 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 look. And I appreciate that. I love that. I loved it. So I'm sure the same thing is gonna probably happen with this one. They're gonna be like, "Hey, look, Lamar Jackson trying to let us know he's coming back. Hey, Lamar Jackson gonna be back this Sunday. And we hope that that's the case.
I keep telling people that um, because I know uh the concern from a lot of people has been is is there gonna be rust? Is Lamar Jackson gonna be rusty? Is he gonna be rusty when he comes back? Look, let me tell you, man. I I could care less about any rust. I ain't I ain't worried about no rust, man. Especially for for what we've been having to see these past like month and change. Yeah, uh, yeah. I ain't I ain't worried about no rust. I ain't worried about no rust. You can worry about the rust all you want. To. I ain't worried about no rust. Because even a, a rusty Lamar is better than what we've been seeing. Um, and, and just imagining like like last week, Anthony Brown. It's tough because if you, if you, if you just look at the numbers, you think, man, that, what a terrible game he had. And the numbers were, they were what the numbers were, but they didn't tell the whole story. They didn't tell the whole story. They didn't tell the, about the drops. They didn't tell about the stepping out of bounds. They didn't. They didn't tell about all that stuff. They did tell about him. Just I mean, I saw somebody say, uh, "Man, Anthony Brown, he had to pass out of bounds." And somebody said, "Oh, he was just he was throwing to a coach. He was throwing to a coach." I said, "Oh, well, yeah, he did." But his his game wasn't as bad as the numbers show it to be. It wasn't. Now, now that first interception was bad. That that was all kinds of bad. But his overall game. And, and it improved as the game went on, but he just he wasn't getting help. Now, with Lamar Jackson, I know so many people have said, and it's a really good point. They're like, man, what is he coming back to? Sammy Watkins? No Deshaun Jackson anymore. Deshaun Jackson got cut, and by Harbaugh's presser yesterday, he ain't coming back. Like, Harbaugh let it be known, like, we'll, we'll probably bring back Nick Boyle. But Deshaun Jackson, no. He the way he talked about him, he was like, "Oh no!" Uh, he, he was like, "Yeah, it, it was it was fun to work with him. We we never I never really got a chance to know him uh, as as the seat as, throughout his career and whatnot. But I got to know him and whatever da da da. And yeah, John Harbaugh said his goodbyes to Deshaun Jackson. So that let us know ain't no practice squad for him, ain't none of that. But for Nick Boyle, he was like, "Oh, he's in our plans. Maybe the practice squad da 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 da." So yeah, so that Deshaun Jackson came and went. He did last longer than Le'Veon Bell did, I believe. But I don't, I, was it the politics thing? I don't know. I don't know why he got cut. We'll see one day. But anyway, um, we're hoping that this is a sign uh, from Lamar Jackson that he knows something. That uh, See, look at that. My, my guy, Matt. Matt dot underscore dot just. He just sent me the Lamar Jackson story literally just now. I, t- I, I know people gonna be keep on sending it over and over. I know they gonna keep on sending it to me over and over, but I, 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 that's why I love y'all. Because anything that I missed, I know Team Keep It Clean, y'all gonna catch it. Because like I said at the beginning of the video, we are all, we private investigators, we researchers, we this, we that. Ravens fans find out, man. Ravens fans find out. They be looking for everything. They, go, they, they be watching for it. Um, but anyway, so we'll see what it means. We'll see what it means starting tomorrow if Lamar Jackson is at practice. And that's what we all hoping for, of course. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. And, like, hopefully Lamar Jackson is no longer when it comes to playing. We out.